5 Worst Government Regimes Ever Throughout history, humanity has experienced the rise and fall of countless governments. Some have brought about peaceful times and freedoms for its citizens, while others have led to despair, destruction, and immense suffering. Today, we're going to delve into five of the worst government regimes the world has ever seen. Our first stop takes us to Germany in the early 20th century, where Adolf Hitler's Nazi regime held power. With anti-Semitic policies and a thirst for global domination, Hitler's reign led to World War II and the genocide of six million Jews during the Holocaust. The world still bears the scars of this brutal regime today. Shifting our gaze to the east, we find Joseph Stalin's Soviet Union. Stalin's rule was a time of terror and paranoia, marked by purges, forced labor, and widespread famine. His policies resulted in the deaths of millions, making his regime one of the most oppressive in history. Speaking of oppression, we must not forget Mao Zedong's rule in China. His great leap forward and cultural revolution caused massive upheaval, economic collapse, and led to the deaths of more humans than any other in the history of humanity. Mao's regime was a classic example of how absolute power can inflict unimaginable suffering on the masses. Next up is Pol Pot's Khmer Rouge regime in Cambodia. In just four years, from 1975 to 1979, Pol Pot orchestrated a brutal social engineering plan that led to the death of nearly a quarter of Cambodia's population. His reign of terror is remembered as one of the most lethal in history. Finally, we move to Africa, where Idi Amin's rule in Uganda was marked by gross human rights abuses, political repression, corruption and even cannibalism. His eight-year reign resulted in the deaths of up to half a million people. Amin's regime is a stark reminder that a leader's lust for power can lead to a nation's downfall. Sadly, these are just a few examples of the devastating impacts of despotic regimes. Each of these governments was marked by a disregard for human life, a lust for power, and a lack of respect for basic human rights. These regimes serve as grim reminders of the dark side of power and authority. They underline the importance of checks and balances in governance, the need for transparency, and the value of human rights. In conclusion, we must remember these regimes not to dwell on the past, but to learn lessons for the future. We must strive for a world where such atrocities are a thing of the past, where leaders are held accountable, and where every individual's rights are respected and protected. Let's remember, it's not just about how a government is structured, but about how it values and treats its people. The power of a government should always be used to uplift its citizens, not to suppress, oppress, or exploit them. As we reflect on the horrors of the past, let's strive to create a better tomorrow.